let the poor breathe let the rich also breathe okay that's life now just one we do have double lives uh some persons might want to claim they have nine lives or more or choke i know say you get nine me i get one or die now die nine or one or die now die okay it's no longer news that uh a nigerian talent manager polo a uh, lover to nollywood actress uh yabo ojo has actually placed 5 million naira to anyone who can find the location of a social media user that wished Nigerian singer Davido death. It happened over the weekend. It has been crazy from Davido getting into trouble for calling some artists new cats to Davido supposedly calling out uh, Whiskey's mom on Twitter and uh, Whiskey FC. They were not having it. Like it's been crazy banter back and forth, back and forth. Like. <laughs> The information choked. The gist was just coming back to back to back to back to back. The gist was much. I was so overwhelmed by the activities that was going on and I couldn't really post. We knew that David Doe in an interview uh, called some uh, artists new cat. And you know what new cat means? When they say you're new cat, that means you're just up and coming. You're just getting into limelight. And for someone to call you a new cat, that means the person has been there before you. That's what it obviously means. And uh, Bonaboy was not having it. <laughs> but he didn't come out directly to attack the video. He just said, show us the color of your Bugatti. And that was it. And now, Bonaboy did a show and uh, a fan on Twitter decided to drag the video into the whole scenario. Papa Olu Obio, TMW boss. Eh? Just the house, JJ, and this guy just came on Twitter and said, Even if Davido dies, that the crowd his funeral is going to pull is not going to be up to the crowd that Bonaboy's show eventually pulled. And Davido was not having it. Something led to something, and uh, Whiskey came into the picture. And Davido didn't directly said Whiskey's mom, he just said that in Mama's their life. So we don't know who he's actually referring to. He might be referring to the troll who came at him or he might be referring to anybody, okay? But Whiskey FC were not having it. They were just giving the video back to back. Uh, I couldn't really get uh, some of the twists to show you guys because uh, most of them they've been deleted. So I'm going to post the ones I was able to. We all know the video is still on tour, right? So he just came on Twitter and just said, oh, man, He's tired, he needs to go for rehaza for his tour. And man, it's not easy. Being up there, being famous, like a lot of persons are just gonna be angry with you unnecessarily. A lot of persons are just gonna be envious of you or what you've achieved. I don't blame David at all. I know most people will be like, why? David talks too much. Yes, I know he talks too much. Come on, if you were in his shoe, I bet you you would do worse why because you know that he hustled his way up despite the fact that he was from a rich home he didn't get that preferential treatment so he hates it when someone comes out and be like hey your papa get money now that's why you made it quick in the music industry i watched uh, one of the interview from one of his cousins and the guy opened a lot of things to what he went through growing up and i was like man really so he want the rich the kids of the rich to know what it is to make it in the streets i was super impressed with how far they have come and their achievement trust me i won't lie okay so like i was saying if i want taku polo for seeking public validation adding that he can easily be found and nothing would happen to him <laughs> the guy's handle winko underscore three wrote and i quote polo is funny he they put five million on my head <laughs> laughing my ass off bald headed toothless man using evil sense to decide people for public validation if you really want to find me you can easily do that without making noise on social media and one when you do that i promise you that nothing will happen <laughs> it's been crazy man it's been crazy it's been crazy i'll keep you guys updated on how everything turns out and how everything is going to pan out okay but i want you to just please subscribe because your subscription is what encourages me to keep you guys abreast and updated on what is happening. So please subscribe and make sure you always drop your comments. Just drop your comments, whatever you think, just post there. Trust me. So you don't want to miss any of this juicy gist for anything. Just keep your notification bell on and get notified when I drop those content. I love you. Bye for now.